Maturity Under a Supermoon by William Meyer Seeds are planted and grow through each season. Winter cradles potential hidden from sight and smell and sound. It lies hidden from every predator. Spring brings breakthrough and independence. Sum summer brings labor and toil to the creature and farmer alike. Autumn reveals an abundance, the potential of seed manifested in beauty and splendor, or crushed in deceit and disappointment. Just weeks before, just a few decades ago, he drove by pretending to shoot. Bullets of air grilled no one, leaving everyone unscathed. But weeks later, victims fell where once pride and anti-judge had condemned violently. Children go to work in a retail fever. Palatial malls lure them to shop till they drop. They buy, they sell. The line twixt and tween is murky. No one can really discern one from the other. Silly swarming over goods and perhaps not so goods. But the joy is in the frenzy and the feast. Shooting and violence erupt. Innocence is its first victim. Knowledge floods every sense. The shooter dies. But how many others, how many could not dodge the flesh he could not manage? How many could not nurture the spirit suffocating in despair? Lights enough for ten houses fill a small lot. A mailbox worthy of an estate announces ambitions beyond constraint, maniacal omens. Dogs are raised unleashed without regard for others. Big dogs threatening homes that are not their own. Flesh has overstepped its bounds, because the bounds were not built. So with these three, so many toothpicks against my weary eyelids. Under this brilliant, stunning, amazing super moon, the inspiration comes to light. Arms are once again for me to bear, in service to Jesus, family, and country. The stage is set. Maturity beckons to the despisers of discipline. Jesus' paternity is offered to these once more. The harvest draws nigh. We are all in its embrace. For light, for darkness, for love, for hatred, for abundance, for despair. We are here at the threshold of maturity under a supermoon.